I, you know, I think we had some opportunities to make plays. We weren't able to do it. Um, you know, they were able to control the line of scrimmage the better part of the second half. And, you know, I think when, when, when you know, a team's able to run the ball on you like they were today, you know, th that's tough to stop. And, you know, credit to our, our, our guys. You know, they hung in there for four quarters. And we knew, you know, coming on the road would be, be a tough ball game. And, and uh, you know, I thought our kids were, played well. And, um, you know, I'm proud of the effort. Yeah, you know, that, that's what you know, we talked to the kids all week. It, it was going to be a 60 minute ball game, you know, and, and it was, you know, I, I, down two scores, you know, until you get, you know, under 30 seconds, you know, you, you've got an opportunity to win the game. So, um, you know, I'm proud of the guys. They, they did a nice job. Like I said, um, you know, I think we learned a lot. I, I think that's probably going to be what, what we take, you know, forward from this experience. You know, this is our first shot in the playoffs. And I think we learned a great deal as, as a program. And, um, you know, that, that, that makes it exciting headed into the offseason. Well, I think we probably, you know, learned a little bit more about the weight room today. Um, there's some big guys, you know, and, and we've got to be able to hold up and, you know, in those situations for 60 minutes, and, and that attitude comes from the weight room. So, you know, as we look at it, that that's going to be something that we take a real close look at moving into the off season and how we can improve in that area. Um, you know, just the overall experience. You know, I'm sure the talk on campus was rampant all week. Everybody's excited about the first ever playoff game, and you know, we've got to learn to tune those things out. And I think we've had a couple of opportunities this year. You know, to play in really, really big ball games, um, and that takes practice. That you know, that, that's something that the guys need to get used to. And um, you know, again, just something that we'll learn from this experience. Yeah, you're really proud of the guys. Um, you know, you, you think back to, to when you check in on August the 11th, and you know, if somebody asks you, you know, would you would you take a MAC championship and a nine and two record? I don't know that a whole lot of coaches would say no. Um, you know, but you know, at Stevenson, you know, we, we strive to win every ball game, and that's what we want to do. And um, you know, of course, we're disappointed, but I think when we look back, particularly at this group of seniors who finished their careers, you know, with a 31 and 13 record, um, and, and six of those losses came in, the, in their freshman year. So, um, very accomplished senior class. Those guys, I mean, really, really helped us elevate our program to the next level. And, and, and I'm very grateful for, you know, for the work that they put into the program. And you know, so. To digest, it's a lot, but you know, there's a lot of great people out there, a lot of people that we'll need to thank over the next couple of days and um, you know, start moving toward 2017.